Hello friends and family from the Florida Mall. I thought it'd be a really fun idea to show you guys something different away from the theme parks. And they have a restaurant here at the Florida Mall right behind me, Buca de Beppo. I cannot wait to eat here. They had this in New York City. It is some fine Italian food. And again, I am just so excited to show you the theming. It is amazing. And then also, I think we're gonna stop for some dessert here in the Florida Mall. You're not gonna wanna miss that. Before we get started, if you click that subscribe button and bell notification so you're aware of future uploads and live streams, we would really appreciate it. So right over here we have the main entrance for Buca de Beppo and then we have the Florida Mall entrance and they also have right over here the Crayola experience. I feel like this would be a lot of fun uh, to do with Luke one day as well. But today we're heading over here to Buca de Beppo. So right now we're inside of the Florida Mall. Here's some of the signage here for Buca de Beppo. You can also sit out here, but I really love these like old statues that they have here. They do birthdays, anniversaries. Look at that, they even have a sign there for color TV. I just love the, uh, the like the bright signs though. Like this is really, really cool. When immigrant Italian dining. So this is the entrance you can actually enter inside the mall right here. And it says meatballs right there. How funny is that? I really love it in here already. Look at all the people enjoying some really good Italian food. Italian number one. We have a cake up here. Some really, really just nifty pictures that they have in here. It completely lines the walls. Look at this one. There's no picture in that frame. <laughs> oh, look at this. Meet Miss Buka right here with an authorized signature. Look at that. Right over here on the door, they have a contact free to uh, view the menu online if you want to go ahead here and scan the QR code right there. Look at this, they even have pictures of Danny DeVito, Celeste, Sylvester Stallone, and Charlie Sheen. Like, this is really, really just amazing, all the decor in here. Oh, look at that. Get out of town. It's the governor, <laughs> Arnold Schwarzenegger. They actually put us in a booth here right next to Jolt and Joe DiMaggio. That's like so perfect being at an Italian restaurant like this. Look at the lady here. She's kicking a soccer ball in her wedding dress. That is too funny. This is really, really amazing, just the theming in here. It reminds me of just like an old school Italian bar, I guess. Here is a uh, um, prosciutto. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Get a once over the menu, because we're actually here for lunch right now. So they do have a lunch menu, but it's normally family style where you'll get the small or the large. I think the small feeds three people and the large five to six people, but they have like a Caesar salad, a chopped antipasti. For the entrees, we have chicken parm, salmon sorrento, chicken limon, I think that's what I'm gonna get, eggplant parmesan. For pastas, they have lasagna, baked ziti, spicy chicken rigatoni, spaghetti with meatballs, and we also already ordered the uh, mozzarella garlic bread. Really excited for that one. So they just brought out our mozzarella garlic bread and this looks delicious. And again, this is like a family size, so just keep in mind like all of the bread that they do give you. If it's just two of you, you're probably not gonna be able to eat all this. You always say Okay, that. here we go. Let's try the garlic bread. It's kind of in the shape of a, a pizza right here. <laughs> mm. Very fresh. That's really good. And you can see the cheese kind of melted right there on the top. The garlic bread though is really, really good. I like it. So I went with the chicken limon here and it also has a fettuccine alfredo. They do ask you what kind of pasta you want. This looks delicious. Then my mom got the uh, same chicken right here, but you got the uh, pasta with red sauce. That looks like a heaping lot of sauce on top of that too. And then Brandy got the uh, baked, baked, ziti. baked ziti. Look at that. That looks so delicious. I also got a side Caesar salad, and I do have to say that is probably one of the best Caesar salads I've ever had. Yeah. Oh, and then Luke over here, he went with the uh, kids pepperoni pizza. And again, this looks really, really delicious too. 
All right, let's go ahead and sprinkle some Parmesan cheese all over this. Oh, this looks so good. <laughs> I think we'll go ahead and try the uh, fettuccine Alfredo first. Very good. All right, let's go ahead and try the uh, fettuccine Alfredo. Mmm. <laughs> that is very thick and creamy. That's good. Yeah, that's really good. Fettuccine Alfredo's two thumbs up. And the pasta seems like it is uh, homemade. Yeah, it does. Yes, it does. Now we'll go ahead here and try the chicken limon. Look at that. It's like dripping in sauce. It has capers on it too. Oh man. <laughs> Very, very lemony. The capers are really good on it. The chicken is just delicious. It's very, very juicy. I highly recommend this. Very, very good. So the food here at Buca de Beppo, absolutely delicious. Very, very filling, I will say that. So we're actually gonna, I think, just walk around the mall a little bit and then we'll go for dessert. We have my mom with us, so I'm actually surprising her with dessert. I'm really excited for that. So we're going to go ahead, walk around the mall a little bit and grab dessert. I can't wait to show you guys what they have for dessert in here at the Florida Mall. Also I wanted to mention in here in the restaurant, they had mentioned that they have like different themed rooms. So they actually have like a mafia room in there and like we kind of like the sports one with Joe DiMaggio and some boxers. So you can actually maybe request to be in a specific room if you like. I think the mafia room sounds really interesting. When Matthew comes home. Um, for Christmas time, I think I'm going to request to get that room. That'd be a lot of fun. Also, look how beautiful the Santa Claus is here. Hi, Santa. <laughs> right here it says farewell. He is so, so beautiful. Aw, that's just amazing. I love the whole theming that Santa has right here. Like, this is really amazing. There's a sign right there for Santa. Oh, look at this. They also have North Pole Mail. So you can mail your letter right here to Santa Claus as well. They have these beautiful Christmas trees. <laughs> Tis the season for sure. And I also think they do have Mrs. Claus here as well. Like, that's incredible. And here's another one. Look at that. Letters for Santa. This mall is really amazing so far and Santa Claus is so cool. We're actually heading on over to get dessert right now. My mom's going to be really, really excited for this one. <laughs> I'm excited thinking about it. Me too. <laughs> Look at this guys. They have Carlo's Bakery. This is amazing. Like this is from Hoboken. If you've ever seen the show Cake Boss, they have his bakery right here in the food court. I'm going to head on in, check out some of the different theming on the walls here with Buddy and all of his ingredients. They also make cakes in here as well. And then we're going to try some of the desserts. Look at this right here though. There's Buddy, his mom, some of the uh, cupcakes and slices of cakes in here. Look at this all the way back here. You can order your Carlos Bakery cake. Look at this. It even looks like they have lip glosses as well. And it's completely decorated here for the holidays. Back here though is where they make all of the uh, cakes, which is amazing in its own right. But look at some of these. They have a beautiful wedding cake right here. And we have a golf cake. Happy birthday. Fortnite. Oh, Luke wants to show the Fortnite cake right here. And look at all of these ones right here. Look at, we have chocolate fudge cake for $29.95. We have a vanilla confetti cake, strawberry shortcake. Cannoli cakes for $34.95. You can also get cake by the slice right over here. Like, how delicious do these look? Strawberry rainbow cake slices, vanilla confetti cake slices. These are $7.95. And then down here, look at this. We have apple crumble pies, pumpkin pies, pecan pies, individual cannoli cheesecakes, strawberry cheesecakes. Look at this one. They have a chocolate dip cheesecake right there with a strawberry on top for $7.95. Look at those down there, Ma. Strawberry shortcake tower. They look delicious. They have a photo op right here with Buddy himself, which is really, really amazing. But look down here. You can actually purchase some of the uh, Carlos Bakery Cake Boss merchandise here. They have white coffee mugs for $10, red ones, clear pint glasses, 
all ten dollars. They have a hot and cold clear tumbler for fifteen dollars. Then they have the down here, the premium water bottles right here in red and white. These are nineteen ninety five. And then I absolutely love the uh, Carlos Bakery T-shirts that they have here as well. I think this is really neat. They have Buddy right here with his entire family right here. A TLC Cake Boss Carlos Bakery, which is really, really neat. And I also love this little onesie right here, fresh out of the oven, Carlos Bakery. Isn't that cool? And the used T-shirts are ten dollars each, two for eighteen. Original price is twenty dollars. I'm so excited for this trip because Buca de Beppo was like New York City. Carlos Bakery is New York City. It definitely kind of just reminds us of home. So like this is just wonderful. I can't wait to show you guys some of the theming of the boxes they have here for Carlos Bakery. Some of the desserts we just got and then we're going to try some. Look at this box right here. Carlos Bake Shop since 1910 Hoboken, New Jersey. You can also on www.carlosbakery.com order some stuff. They have express pickup or delivery. Then we got a black and white cookie here, and then we got the uh, chocolate chip cookie. But we're gonna open this guy up right here and try some of this. Let's go in here and uh, pop this sticker up. We'll check it out. Look at that, I got the uh, cannoli cheesecake, and my mom got the uh, strawberry shortcake. These both look very, very delicious. How delicious does this cheesecake look? And I will say, his cheesecake is very, very good. We've had it in Hoboken before, actually in Hoboken, New Jersey, but I've never had the cannoli cheesecake before. I'm really excited to try it. It looks like it has like a cannoli topping right here, and then the crust from the actual cannoli is right here with some powdered sugar and uh, chocolate drizzled right there on it. I'm gonna go ahead and try the uh, cannoli with the, with the filling right here first. Very, very good. <laughs> Definitely reminds me of New York City. I can't wait to get on into this cheesecake right here. Oh my word. <laughs> we haven't had this in so long. Oy, oy, oy. <laughs> Look at that. That looks so delicious. All right, let's go ahead and try this cannoli cheesecake. This looks so delicious. Well, he's savoring it. Let me just say, this is fabulous. <laughs> and that cheesecake is so creamy, just like I remember it from New York and Hoboken, New Jersey. Very, very delicious. Just a fantastic day here at the Florida Mall today. <laughs> we had such a great day today at the Florida Mall. Some fantastic food at Bupa de Beppo and just the food was absolutely delicious. Carlos Bakery here at the Florida Mall. Again, it just feels like home. I'm so happy that we spent the day here. If you like today's video, give it a big thumbs up, and as always, make today awesome.